Hey everyone, Matt King with the King Pierce team, back out here with another video showcase of the nation's very best engineering sound foundation repair. If you'd like to see more, we highly encourage you to visit us over on our YouTube and Facebook channels. If you haven't visited before, just search for King Piers LLC. And while you're there, we'd really appreciate it if you left a like and a subscribe. We are back up here in Perry, Kansas. We are in the process of trying to wrap up the straightening of this front foundation wall that was leaning outward. That's why we have our six by sixes and 30 ton bottle jacks set up on the outside aiming to push this wall back to uh back to vertical we are we're very close um we just took a look at the levels on the inside which we'll go uh show you here in a moment um but we mainly have roughly a half inch uh or so left to go to get this this is a not a typical house uh the way like most of our wall straightening jobs go this is a a very long wall it's uh, quite a bit taller than most that we've done so th this isn't a, a fast deal on on getting this there's a lot of adjustments we're making as we do each each push and extension of the jacks um so we're we're making sure that we kind of get everything in line together as we uh, as we're pushing this wall back so uh we've been adjusting the placement of our six by sixes and our jacks as we've been been starting on this this morning uh, but i mean this is the this is the system um it's it's a six by six extruded wood support post 30 ton bottle jack and then just hand cranking those jacks will slowly push that wall back to vertical um, this is all going to remain in place until we get the bracing installed that's what keeps that wall in place um, we'll take a quick look here now on the level and see where we're at so here right by the door I mean, we are, we're pretty close. Just a hair more on that. And then as we move towards the middle, this is where we've been having to push more. Um, the ends are pretty close, but the middle is where we still have maybe a half inch or so left to do. So you can see this gap right here, we have just a little bit more that we're aiming to do um, but we should be hopefully here within the hour have this wall finished up we've already straightened the back wall this was the one that was leaning inward we've since got this pushed back to its correct vertical position um, we've started getting our wall braces installed uh, once that front wall is in place we'll get the other uh, shorter braces that are going to be on the uh, underneath the front end of these horizontal load bearing beams. We'll start getting those set up. Um, a lot of the bracing that we're going to be installing on this back wall is going to be setting on the footing for the uh, the pier holes that we've already exposed uh, the footings on the front wall. Since we're doing all of the piers from the outside, we're going to have to uh, individually saw cut and break up the the holes to expose the footing. You can see we've already marked out the ones below the uh, horizontal load bearing beams. Um, so we'll do the rest um, once we have this wall pushed back. Um, but again, just to uh, uh, go over everything on this project, we have two walls, the front and the back that are being straightened back to vertical. Seven piers are going under the footing on both walls. The ones on the front are on the outside. Ones on the back are on the inside epoxy injection of the cracks. We've got the port set and that first uh, surface layer of fast setting epoxy on the back wall. Uh, once we're wrapped up with the peering, that's when we'll do the injection. And then we have 10 wall braces, 10 H-beam wall braces that are gonna be installed on the interior side of both walls. So four on each wall are gonna be the shorter ones that you see that are gonna be underneath the load bearing beams. And then the remaining six on each wall are gonna go all the way up and be secured into the ceiling joist. 
So uh, hopefully we should be aiming to have this project pretty much wrapped up by the end of this week. Um, probably by Wednesday, we'll start putting the piers in the ground, start getting concrete out here to encase the piers. And then uh, that's also when we're gonna be wrapping up the crack repair. And then the latter part of the week should just be tidying up the yard, getting the outside walls uh, waterproofed and backfilled. So um, we're, we're moving along, we're getting close, and uh, we, can, uh, we can see the end uh, rapidly approaching on this project. So stay tuned for more updates. You'll be able to find those on our YouTube and Facebook channels. If you just search for King Piers LLC, you can also go to our website, kingpiers.com. And don't forget, you can always call us directly by phone at 1-816-288-4373.